I'm telling the truth. I don't know any arms dealers. Those mania weapons came to us from various channels. I really don't know who they were. Oh, right. Well, uh, we'll round up the Legion after killing you. Uh, the Director's order is for us to take back the Inheritance and kill the Legion Center who escaped from the MBCC. The Director tried to tweak some information to manipulate that new MBCC Chief into taking care of the whole thing, but the new Chief wasn't much of an order follower. I know there's someone behind the Mania weapons. I also know the Public Security Bureau has a connection with them. Your subordinate has given us quite a lot of information. And there will be no reinforcements for you for the time being. Stop beating around the bush, Burns. My patience is running thin. Well, at this point, I guess it won't hurt to tell you the truth. Over a decade ago, the gangs here were out of control. Many gangsters attempted to cross the rust to attack the east side. I was the chief of the local security precinct back then. An order from the Public Security Bureau arrived at my desk, which instructed me to purge this place at all costs. The order came with a man who called himself an arms dealer. He said he could make my troubles go away. The arms dealer controlled the supply of weapons to the various gangs. He could help me build a balance of power among the gangs, and he would be able to keep the syndicates in the West District so that they wouldn't cause troubles in the East Side. He made good on his promises. More importantly, he wants nothing but money. He won't try to build up his power base and take over a syndicate. He's also promised to always stay behind the scene and get involved only when I need him to. The problems of the West District can finally be solved. Finally. His solution was to string the gangsters along with the promise of making them the overlords of Syndicate, then incite violence to drive up the price of arms. You, on the other hand, can control Syndicate at a low cost with the help of the arms dealer. You don't care about the lives of ordinary people anyway. Well, it's you and the arms dealer who are the real masters of Syndicate, not those short-lived overlords. Is the spreading of mania weapons part of your plan too? I'll handle it. I'll be able to. Who are these people? Where are they? What do they want? Oh, I can tell you all that, but what would you do when you find them? So yeah, for all this time, you've been chasing new enemies. First the gangs, then the mania peddlers. What next? The Public Security Bureau? The East Side? The entire city? You really think your syndicate will be all the better if you eradicate them all? Hell no. All you do is wreak destruction. You can't bring any real change. Don't give me that crap. Answer my questions. Go on! You're not the savior of the syndicate! <laughs> your power is the only source of your confidence! And you have nothing but that violent power of yours! You can't defeat him! The stronger you get, the more you are doomed to failure! Sit on you! Count your feet! Yourself! You're the man behind him.
Yes. Syndicate has a new master. I've come to present a congratulations gift. I won't let you get your way! Oh. That's the spirit. Treat me as an enemy. Exactly. And more than one of them. Syndicate deserves more. You deserve more. Fight, Zoya. Fight with your true form. It's always been you that they desire. <laughs> 